Today on BladeHQ.com, we're taking a look at the JigPro Stainless Steel Paracord FID. Kind of a cool little tool if you do a lot of paracord work. This is definitely going to be an awesome little thing for you. Now you're probably wondering what is a FID. Basically, it's a threaded needle. So there are threads in there and then you burn your paracord to fit on this needle. And uh, you just screw it in there like so and then you can do paracord projects. So for instance, if you're working on wrapping the handle of a knife, to finish this, you're going to pull this piece of paracord through the entire thing. So typically you would use hemostats to do that. And it's gonna take you some time because you have to pull it through each individual um, loop there. But with this Jig Pro, basically what you do is you just go under it. It's a needle. It's turns your paracord into a needle and thread. So you can go right under it just like that, use it in that fashion. So pretty cool little tool, especially if you're doing a lot of paracord work. And for the price, this one is $6.95, $6.95, super cheap, stainless steel, two and uh, three quarter inches. And there's also an $8.95 one with an extender. And this one is four and a half inches. So that extender just screws in there. Anyway, I'm gonna show you how to use it because I'm sure you're wondering as I wondered. I had a tutorial with our product manager and he showed me how to do this. Hopefully I can replicate it. I've tried a couple times, but uh, I think this time is going to be the charm. So you've got your paracord and uh, not gutted paracord. You're just going to take a lighter and get the lighter going. Hang on. And you're going to catch the paracord on fire. Let me get this in frame for you here. So just burn it till it catches on fire. Don't drip it on your fingers because it hurts. I've seen it happen. Then you're going to take a piece of paper and you're just going to roll it. And you're going to turn it into kind of a point. That's the goal here, if I can get it right. Hot paracord, not good on the fingers. Now, I think it works best if you just thread that in while it's a little bit warm. And then you're just going to screw it in. You're basically creating threads on the paracord side. Just screw it right in like that. And bam, you've got yourself a needle. And the nice thing about it is if you've done this right, you can put a lot of pressure on there. Yeah, I mean, I'm putting a ton of pressure. And that's not going to go anywhere. So if you've got an intense project that needs a lot of detail work and a lot of pulling and threading and that sort of thing, this is really a great little invention. So pretty darn cool. And then I mentioned the uh, extension right here that just screws in. So if you've got a bigger project or whatever, maybe you're making a hammock. I don't know. Paracord is like incredible. Same thing, just screws in and you're ready to go. So like I said, that's going to make your life easy when you go to thread in between pieces like that. So obviously that's not gonna be easy with the extender, but you get the idea. Pretty cool little tool and it's super cheap. So save your fingers, that sort of thing. It's $6.95 on bladehq.com. And for the extender, the, uh, the two pieces come together, $8.95. So pretty good deal, especially if you do a lot of paracord work. And I would encourage you to buy it at bladehq.com before I take off. Let me show you it in comparison to a tactical clothespin because that's how we roll here at Blade HQ. Check it out, size comparison wise. Bam, you get the idea. So check it out, buy it at bladehq.com.